Good morning. I have absolutely no idea what this vlog is supposed to go today. I'm sure y'all gonna be able to figure it out by whatever title I decide to put at it at the end of the day. But as of right now, me and Bae just got up. We finna get ready to get dressed and go to the park. So I'm finna go do that now and we'll meet y'all there. Right now we're on our walk and my little quick question to y'all is when you the path that we walking so we walking this way and other people walking this way and when we pass them the first time we always speak we always say hey but when we pass them the second time or the third time do we speak again or do we just keep walking because i noticed we spoke to that man and we had already passed him and he passed us again and looked down but i was smiling at him because i thought i was gonna speak again so it would be weird to speak again Oh, well, I thought you were supposed to speak every single time you walk past somebody, but I guess I need to stop doing it. I'm not going to film much while we actually on our walk right now because we actually having a good conversation right now. So I guess I'll check back in with y'all again yeah, once I make it back to the house. You said you want to walk around? Yeah, we don't got to. It's a path this way that I love to walk and through the trees and the woods that he absolutely... Why you hate it so much? I guess we're gonna walk the open field. The open field, he like the walk. It ain't no shade. It ain't number of sun. The sweat be on 10. I like the trees because I get a good cover it. But mm -hmm. I guess we're gonna just walk this one more time and then I'll check back in with y'all when we either in the car or we back at home while we figure out what we're gonna do for the rest of the day. We in and our walk now. We crossing the parking lot to get back to the car. This asphalt is hot. I swear to you, it's hotter walking across the parking lot than it is walking the little trail around the park. And let me tell y'all the most disgusting thing, baby. You okay with me saying how nasty we is before we get come to the park? <laughs> how nasty we is. Now, he did shower. He did get up this morning and he showered before we came here. But I swear to y'all, anytime we go walking, I just roll, wake up, I get dressed, and I go out there. I ain't brush my teeth. I ain't wash my face. I ain't put on an extra deodorant. Cause I get sweaty and nasty and I know I'm finna go back home and take a shower. So I be nasty, he okay, he ain't nasty. He showers, but I be up out here, funky breath, head swing, just dirty. So let me go home, I'm gonna take a shower and then again, we are gonna figure out what we finna do for the rest of the day. We headed home now, my man just ran the store, but let me take a quick second to bread real quick because I know it kind of be hurt his feelings when I talk about this. But y'all, I have officially lost 130 pounds. I used to be 325 pounds. I am now 195 pounds. I have not been in the 100s club since I was in middle school. Like I'm telling y'all, I weighed 175 pounds when I was 11 years old. I happened to step on the scale yesterday because my sister was like, you look really small. Have you not weighed yourself? Somebody walking by and they just stared at me and it just made me feel so uncomfortable let me turn this air down but i was like no i had not weighed myself and i decided to just step on the scale just for no reason i could have cried when i seen how little i was and of course my man gave me my praises he was super excited for me but now i could tell he kind of been down because his weight then went up since mine been going down. And I feel so sad for him, y'all, because I want him to feel just as confident as I feel in my body. But I did want to take the time to brag about myself real quick because I've been bragging about myself for the last two days in front of him. He getting ready to come back in the car from the guy. Shut up. But I will see y'all when I get home. We back at the house now. I feel like I'm not actually taking y'all nowhere with me. And I keep just telling y'all what I've done and what I'm finna do after the fact. So what I'm finna do now, I'm finna go ahead, take my shower. I'm finna get dressed, and then we're gonna go to the grocery store together. I need to go get some for me and Bay to eat for dinner tonight and tomorrow so I'm gonna fully get dressed and then I will actually let y'all grocery shop with me so we'll meet back up at Walmart y'all I am so tired I just got done taking me an everything shower then after I got done with the shower I sat down I started coloring for a little bit I think my lips dry I started coloring for a little bit and I'm tired like I'm so tired me and Bay have already decided he want to go to well he doesn't want to, but I'm making him go to the grocery store with me today. So we actually gonna just wait until later. We're gonna probably go to the grocery store tonight at like eight or something, which I'm still gonna take y'all with me to go there. But what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna cook us something. It's already two o'clock in the afternoon and we haven't ate a single thing today. So I'm gonna bake us some bacon and eggs, which I'm gonna show y'all our place when we get done. So let me go cook this food so we can get the rest of this day on. 
I'm a little nervous about this meal because I did something different. Well, first I made our bacon. I made that the same way I normally make it. I put black pepper and brown sugar on top of it. Threw that in the air fryer, nothing no different. I gave Bake three pieces. I gave myself one piece. And then I made some toast in the air fryer. Let's look at the toast buttery crispy yes these are hamburger buns but the reason i did hamburger buns is because i poached eggs for the first time i've never poached an egg before and i looked up some tiktoks last night gordon ramsay taught me how to poach an egg and let me just show y'all these eggs they don't look too bad. They said to lay it on some cardboard so that it can dry out better. Y'all see them steaming, but they look perfectly poached, so I'm hoping they is. So what I'm gonna do is take the eggs and roll them onto the top of the biscuit, and then I'm gonna show y'all the finished result. So I got my poached eggs on the plate. They said sprinkle a little pepper on them, so I'm gonna sprinkle a little pepper little pepper if it'll come on out and they said not to add any extra salt because i basically cooked it in the salt and i'm gonna just put a little jelly on the side i feel like we're not gonna need no jelly because of what we have but let me go ahead and take bay his plate I ain't lie, when I was transferring the egg to the plate, it was feeling kind of hard and not runny like I needed on the inside. So I'm gonna let y'all look at this with me. Let's see. It's supposed to be runny when I crack this egg. No no i overcooked that it's not runny enough i wanted it to like ooze it's somewhat oozy but let me eat this and then i'm gonna check back in with y'all i most definitely overcooked this egg but i asked Bay how he like it he said he don't care it still tastes good so now that i'm eating this when i get done eating breakfast i'm actually going to call and pay off a few bills on my credit that way you know we're trying to buy a house so i need to go ahead and get that taken care of now after that I'm probably going to get ready to go to the store because by the time I get done being on the phone with all these different credit card companies, I'm positive it's going to be already pushing 7 o'clock. So I'll take y'all to Walmart with me to go get dinner. But my actual dinner, I'm going to film that to go on TikTok. So go follow me on TikTok. But I will check back in with y'all officially when we make it to Walmart tonight. I'm at Walmart now and I don't usually come to Walmart at nighttime alone so I'm kind of nervous about going to Walmart for some reason but the reason I told Bay not to come with me to Walmart is because one I forgot to go by the bank today to go get some cash out for my little savings binder and I have a little secret cash stash that I keep away so I want to go and get some cash back when I'm at the register and I didn't want him to see that and two me and my sister decided that we're going to go take some pictures together somewhere tomorrow so I want to find one of those little recyclable boho bags for and I want us to be able to look around up in the clothing section and not have him judge me for it. But the only thing as far as food that I'm getting up out of here, I'm getting a packet of chicken wings and I'm getting some type of, I think he said he want Brussels sprouts to go on the side. So I'm gonna get some chicken, get some Brussels sprouts, find his little handbag and get some cash back. I'm gonna take y'all in the store with me, but be, be mindful because I'm telling y'all that I'm nervous to be in the store talking to myself and nobody with me. So don't judge me if all this footage looks like trash really wanted just some wings but they don't have any but they do got this legs thighs and wings combo so i'm gonna just get that because technically i can eat on that for a couple of days i found the brussels sprouts and the carrots that we were looking for so we're gonna have that for dinner tonight but i'm also gonna pick base some up for tomorrow because i know he's gonna want something to eat tomorrow so i'm gonna get him this little salisbury steak thing and i think i'm probably just gonna eat leftovers tomorrow so let's go find this little handbag where y'all i was just passing through and look at these little athletic dresses they have for girls i have to come back and get baby girl one because i am obsessed with athletic wear so i have to come and find her a dress but i'm gonna need her to try it on to make sure it's fitting right where i came in here for just dinner but look at this matching set it has the little shorts oh the little shorts that go with it this is too cute baby girl gotta come back I swear, this is why I need to stay out of Walmart. Somehow, I always end up in a little clothes section. Look at these little skirts. Baby girl would love that. But okay, we just need to go find this little purse. So let's go over to the little accessories area and find this little purse so I can go home. It is literally past 8 p.m. right now. Put one of those like bag it yourself type bags, like one of those recyclable bags, like a little shoulder made out of plastic material bag. I have looked up and down every single aisle. I do not see the bag that I'm looking for. The closest thing I see is this, but it's clear and I wanted it to be like that recycled brown material, like burlap almost. So I'm just gonna go ahead and check out and get up out of here. Plus it's already nine o'clock and I just Google everything and everything's gonna close. So let's just get up out of here. I 
am so sad right now. So I got my little bag of goodies. But the things that depressed me tonight, one, I did not find that little handbag that I was looking for. And I really need it for the aesthetic of the photo that I'm doing tomorrow. So I feel like it's completely going to throw off my picture. So I'm going to just make whatever I already have in my closet work for tomorrow. And two, when I got to the register, there was a very specific number of cash number. There was a very specific amount of cash I wanted to get in cash back. But the options that they gave for cash back was either way too low or way too high. I didn't want to go way too high because i didn't want him to notice the den in the account so i set up for just a lower amount but tomorrow i'm going by the bank to get the difference of what it was that i needed so i got my my dinner for tonight and it's pretty much it i was gonna run off a list of what all i got but i just got enough dinner for tonight and something for bay to eat for tomorrow y'all have spent the whole day with me basically doing nothing and being indecisive of what i was gonna Ooh, that sounded so hard to say y'all have spent the whole day with me basically being indecisive and not knowing exactly what it is I want to do so I'm gonna go home like I told y'all my dinner I'm posting it tonight on TikTok so y'all can just follow me on TikTok for my dinner and I will talk to y'all later bye